Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Alrighty. So, this is um, the third week, the third week of April. I want to say, uh, <laughs> third week of Ju July. Oh my God, ladies and gentlemen, third week of July. I want to say thank you for being here. We're going to be looking at the energies. This week is a week of balance. So it's an earth week. So it's a wonderful, wonderful week. Um, this earth week is a creating balance for a lot of people. So you cancers who are having birthday is birthdays from the 13 on till the 19. Okay. So, um, um, balance the energy of this year is going to be balanced whatever is happening and transpiring the energy of this year is going to be a whole lot of balance balancing out issues and situation that is transpiring in your world so let's look and see what is coming up okay so we have the energy of the sun for the people who were born on the 13th this is good this is really wonderful it is a positive alignment of energies the energies of the sun have to do with uh, um, you um, heal in certain issues and certain situation that is going to be coming up and transpiring. Now, when we look at the energy of the sun, it's very important to understand that uh, issues and situation that you were dealing with is going to be resolved. Okay, so balance is going to be returned in your life. The energy of the sun is a beautiful energy. Please remember to use the link to check out what is coming up for you guys. So the energy of the sun is going to bring a whole lot of stability. I see heartbreaks. Whoever had heartbreaks, this is going to be ill. A whole lot of heartbreaks. And whoever had heartbreaks is going to be ill. And I see a judgment call is coming up. So whenever we look at these energies and we see all of this is coming up, we are going to be elevating and aligning ourselves to find out what is this heartbreaks over. Because I see whoever that was heartbroken, I see um, an healing is going to be coming in where the sun and there is going to be some form of a judgment call that is coming up. So heartbreaks with stability, whatever is happening and transpiring. If you had issues with uh, your stability, I see that uh, the sun is going to be coming out. I see fortune is going to be returning for you guys. So you're going to be, it's going to be a very fortunate to hear where a lot of positive energy is going to be coming in and is going to be returned. So I see some judgment call. Um, judgment call is coming up and this is going to be good. And this judgment call is going to be created some sort of a stability in your world. And this is going to be good. So I love the energy for you guys who were born on the 13 because it's about healing stability in your world and your fortune is going to be returned okay so some information about your fortune your fortune is going to be returned and this is going to be good so wonderful alignment of energy is going to be coming up then we see the energy of balance for the people who were born on the 14th so this is the energy of the year so you guys are really going to be out balanced whatever is coming up in transpiring we have twice balanced congratulations so whatever issues that you guys were dealing with we have the energy of twice balance and it's balanced with an issue and a situation that some of you have to do with some legal issues um, some information is going to be coming at you that is going to be bringing balance so double Wami, this is good. This is a wonderful positive energy with this double Wami that is coming up because it's creating a lot of balance in your life. This is good. So whatever the issue, the situation is or was, I see transformation is going to be coming up where there is a lot of situation that is going to be balanced out. I see communication is going to be very, very clear. I see some sadness that is coming up. Sadness, whoever was sad, I see this is going to be balanced out. Whoever was dealing with some issue, it's going to be balanced out. And I see this is because of jealousy, a whole lot of jealousy that is happening and transpiring. And I see that as some of you are going to be receiving help in order to resolve whatever issue and situation 
it has to do with your materialistic uh, um, wealth whatever the sadness is and was that is coming up you're going to be releasing it then I see for the people who were born on the 15th you have the energy of the hermit light is being shed on a situation whatever the situation issue is light is being shed on a situation in your life and this is going to be very wonderful and very positive so um some of you are the truth is going to be coming out about a taurus virgo or a capricorn person whoever this person is and whatever is happening and transpiring and i see um whatever the issue between you and this person whether it's um, your mom or um your manager your boss whatever the issue there was you are going to be realizing that this issue this situation is definitely definitely is going to be resolved okay so i see light has been shed i see the end to a deceptive situation that was going on for you people who were born on the 15 so it could be with your boss it could be with a family member whoever this person is whatever that was transpiring i see an end is coming in to the situation um i see um healing is coming in and i see some of you are going to be receiving a really positive message to let you be an alert that uh, certain issues and situation that you were dealing with is now over they're finding out that there was a whole lot of balance that um, um jealousy that was there people who were born on the 16th i see a tall moment i see the end of a situation is coming up a tall moment is coming in this is good and whatever it is it's a tower moment um, on the end of an issue or a situation whether it's with a house whether it's with a, a corporation institution whether it's with your work whether it's with your business i see a tower moment is coming in now the energy with the tower moment and whatever is happening and is transpiring I see you were dealing with some conflicts with some issues, situation, corporation, institution. I see the end is here and the end has came in. So this is um, really wonderful. Whatever that was creating issues, obstacle in your life, I see a real tower moment is uh, transpiring. And this is really good if you decided there was some false eye that was going on and People have seen the truth over the deceptive play that has transpired. So it could be in a corporation, institution, a company. People are now seeing the deceptiveness that was played and the falseness with a car. So a whole lot of you are dealing with a house, a house or your work or your business. They're seeing the deceptiveness that was created. And I see some of you are going to be standing up and bringing a balance to whatever the issue and the situation is. So a lot of you are going to be having issues with house, your work, your business, because you're going to be bringing back balance because there was some false eye that was created and it was because of jealousy. Then we're looking at the people who were born on the 17th and I see a transition is coming up. This is very good. Um, whenever the, the debt comes in, it is very good. Um, some of you are going to be start seeing clearly what was happening. Okay, whatever the issue and the situation is, people are seeing clearly now what has happened and the transition and the problem that was created. However, this came up, you are going to be really um, ill in a situation because I see transition is coming up and the transition has to do with some situation that people weren't seeing clearly people are seeing the truth to some deceptive play that was created by others around you and people are finding out and seeing the truth i see that some of you if someone was sick um for a very long time i see ending is coming in so whoever was sick and was um um uh, it could be ending to your career and I see a whole lot of money is going to be returned to you because they have found out about some lies and deceptiveness that was created around you guys. And I see a whole lot of money is going to be returned to you. So there was some horrible situation that some of you had to deal with. However, it was coming up and transpiring. A whole lot of you were dealing with some issue and some situation. And I see truths are now um, out and people are finding out uh, the deceptiveness that was ha um, happening and transpiring. We're moving on to the people who were born on the 18th. You have the energy of the lovers. So this year is have to do with people in your life, relationship. 
Um, it has to do with a fire sign person. Whatever the situation is, it could be a divorce. Um, someone at your work, uh, whoever this person is, whatever that is happening, entering sparring, people are seeing the truth about this person and some deceptiveness with their family members and themselves. So I see that this is going to be coming out. And however this is happening, entering sparring people are going to be resolving and bringing the end to a situation that has to do with a fire sign person. Whoever this fire sign person is, you could have been dealing with this person in your personal life or it could be in um could be in your personal life but it could be also someone who you were dealing with management some deceptive play with someone in a corporation institution they're seeing this and they're bringing a balance to it so i see trans transformation at end an end is coming to a fire sign person. Whoever this person is, is an um, Aries Leo or Sagittarius person. Whoever this person is, I see debt is here for this person and their family and their relationship because the truth is coming out. And I see that some of you, some money is going to be returned to you. So whoever and whatever that was happening, insurance sparring, you're going to be finding out um, some inconsistency that this person had created and they're going to be um, resolving the issue because they were going to be realizing the deceptiveness that was played by um, it could be a boss or someone who has used their powers in a wrong way and has created a whole lot of issues around you guys a whole lot of issues that is going to be resolved so let's see at the people who were born on the 19 congratulations victory and success overcoming issues and problems that was created um bringing balance to a situation moving forward in your life in a very positive way a tower moment came and resolve the issue and remove an issue out of your life which is very good and i see that it has to do with some deceptive play of a couple that was uh, working against you whoever this person is could be a family member or um, it was some issues that was created by a family member, a sister, brother, whoever this person is. But whatever the deceptive play there was, the people are, are seeing the truth. And I see a very victorious ending is coming to this. And this is um, really, really um, positive. There is a, a situation where a tower moment came down because of some ball play that someone tried to create in your world. Okay. And... Uh, um, I see that whoever this person is or was, I see um, that they're going to be removing this person once and for all because I see um, this person is being removed because they saw the deceptive play. Some of you, I see some conflicts with you and your partner that could be coming up, divorces, separation that could be coming up in this year. Um, so be aware of this because I see uh, some um, issue and situation that you are dealing with where this could be separation um, that is coming up and that sort of a thing with your partner. So be aware, be alert of what is happening and what is transpiring. A transition is definitely coming in. So um, it's going to be a year and there's no question about this, um, this um, year for you guys. There's no question about, um, there is just going to be a year of bringing back balance to issues and situation that was transpiring. There was a whole lot of jealousy that was transpiring and was happening. And I see, um, stability is going to return. There is some sadness, but it's the end of a deceptive situation where there was some false, um, play that has, um, happened and transpired with some of you. And I see ending um because they're going to be finding out something about a fire sign person and the fault and deceptiveness i see your luck is going to be returned um and uh, um whatever that was happening and transpired lux is going to be returned and i see a whole lot of jealousy a whole lot of jealousy that some of you have to deal with and a conflicts with a house i see a resolution it is a year of resolution it's a year of bringing back balance and a year of resolution that is going to be coming in to whatever problems obstacles that was created in your world so this is a really positive alignment of energy where we see a lot of balancing out of issues and situation 
um, that has been transpiring and the obstacles are going to be removed out of your life because of some deceptive play that was created um, by um, other people. And um, with this year, you're going to be like removing people, situation, obstacles that have been created in your world. So it is really a year of um, balancing, a year of bringing back stability in your world. So let's see, let's see. Um, it is um, really, really a, a positive year. So we have two energy, one and two, choose one. If you choose the first one, it's about support. You're going to be receiving a whole lot of support. People are going to be um, helping um, you guys out. It is all about support. It's about support coming up for you guys. So then we have spiritual growth is coming up. So balance is actually the energy of the angel that is going to be working with you guys in order to bring back um, balance in your world. You're going to be growing stronger, whatever is happening and transpiring. You're definitely going to be growing stronger and you're going to be creating a better world around yourself. So this is going to be a good year. Please remember, um, like, share, let me know how um, it's going. Don't forget to go listen to your own um, weekly readings because that is very important for you guys to also work with the weekly readings. It is very important for you cancers because you cancers are going through so much um, this stuff. It's as if you and the fire signs are working out a whole lot of issue um, in this year. Remember that your solar birthday starts the day after your birthday in this year until the day before your birthday next year. And it is always good to order um, a um, yearly reading because this will help you to create a lot of um, um, abundancy in your life because then you will be aware of what is happening and what is transpiring. Whatever falls out and falls um, situation that was transpiring, um, it's going to be resolved. Whatever falls out in a corporation institution, it's going to be resolved. I got to say namaste until next time.